welcome to the next knot of the week for ITS Tactical. Today we're going to be learning how to tie the lanyard knot. Uh, the lanyard knot can be used for the basis of, for instance, a Solomon bar knot, or use as a decorative knot, or even uh, anything that requires a, a loop, a fixed loop. So, that's what a lanyard knot looks like. Uh, we're going to be tying it in this larger piece of rope here uh, to demonstrate this a little easier. So the first step in a lanyard knot is I like using my hand because it makes a, an easy platform for tying it. Uh, what you want to do is you want to loop an end through your pinky finger and then take the slack behind it and you're going to form a knot similar to this. So you're just going to cross a loop behind itself and place it over the standing part. So what you've got here in the middle of your loop is a bar and that's important because the next step is going to be to bring your standing part down here around the back of this which is now your standing part inside that bar and back out. Now if you do this right what you create is a diamond pattern. If you can see that that middle part here, trace that around, is a diamond. So that's going to be important because the next two passes with your strands here are going to come inside of that diamond. So we'll take each end. You've got an end at the top now and an end at the bottom. And this one is going to come around the top and through that middle diamond. So let me show that again. Around the top, passing behind all this, and through that middle diamond. Now this can kind of get a little tricky if you're not paying attention here. So just remember that diamond in the middle comes back around through and in. The same for this side. Uh, this is going to come around the back and inside of that diamond. So now you've got a side that's coming to the right there and a side that's coming to the left. And all you're going to do is flip this down now and that loop that's around those three fingers is now the top of your loop. And all you have to do is pull and start cleaning that up. It's a little harder to show here on screen with the thicker diameter rope, but I'll adjust this as much as I can here. And you're just going to clean this up similar to uh, how we did the monkey's fist. You're just going to kind of trace the lines here. Pulling as you go. So it's definitely not going to look pretty with this thicker diameter rope. But as you can see, with paracord, it's definitely a lot prettier. So this has been an ITS Tactical Knot of the Week on the Lanyard Knot. Thanks for watching.